The time is 6.41 p.m. Good evening. The news headline. Go home and those government begins no vaccine, no work policy. Security operatives mount guards everywhere. The no vaccine, no work policy of Governor Godwin of Baseki State Government has kicked off in Edo State. Governor Obaseki is the first governor in Nigeria to bar unvaccinated people from public spaces, Daily Post reports. Although the move was initially resisted, the governor stood his ground on Wednesday uh, morning. Health officials and security operatives were actually stationed at entrance, entrances of different ministries in Benin, the Edo State capital enforcing the order. An earlier report by the Tribune Online uh, disclosed that the Edo State government will on Wednesday, September 15, 2021, begin the enforcement of restrictions of access to large gatherings for unvaccinated residents of the state, as directed by uh, Governor Godwin Obaseki some three weeks ago. According to the state government, the enforcement will begin with government offices across Edo State as only those who could produce at least the certificate of the first jab of vaccine will be allowed entry. The measure is listed by the Edo State Government as part of intensified efforts initiated to contain the, to contain the pandemic and protect the majority of Edo citizens against the deadly coronavirus following the surge in the number of infections and mortalities in the state. Making the disclosure on Tuesday at the Daily Press briefing on COVID-19 at the government house in Benin City, the Permanent Secretary at the State Ministry of Health, Dr. Osamwony Yorowa, said entry into government offices would be consequent on the presentation of proof of vaccination. If you have to enter the state secretariat and other government offices, you must have your vaccination cards. We are going to implement this in all the key areas to ensure that we don't have people being affect, infected because the other person is proving difficult, Irowa announced. The permanent secretary added that the first phase of enforcement, which, be, which begins tomorrow, September 15th, is targeted at state government facilities, those that cannot provide their COVID-19 vaccination cards may have no excuse, uh, may have to excuse us and be working from home, pending when a decision will be reached. As a state, we are doing everything possible to make sure that people don't get infected, he reiterated. We are appealing to our people to get vaccinated because that is the more suitable, that is the more suitable way to prevent the severity of the disease and avoid death. The enforcement team will commence tomorrow to help us reduce the number of cases and deaths that we are recording daily, he added. Also speaking, the head of COVID-19 enforcement team, Yusuf Aruna, noted that the state government had trained 20 special teams across uh, the state to commence the enforcement of no vaccination, no entry into government-owned facilities. As well all know, the government has the responsibility of protecting the lives and properties of citizens. In, in view of this, we have trained 20 special teams that will be spread across the 18 local government areas of the state. They will commence this enforcement from the 15th of September 2021. What we expect our people to do is that while going to work, they should go with their vaccination cards. The government is not forcing anybody to take the vaccines, but it has the responsibility to tell you not to spread the virus. What we are going to do tomorrow is to grant those who have the authentic vaccination card access to their government working places, and those without the cards can go back and work from home. These 20 special teams will be saddled with the responsibility of scanning and confirming the authenticity of the vacation, uh, vaccination cards and also diligently asking those who don't have to go and work from home. This is the directive of the state government and it will be enforced uh, to the letter, Aruna assured. 
the federal government of Nigeria has announced that it will be making COVID-19 vaccinations available to Nigerians in Christian worship centers on Sundays. This was disclosed on Tuesday by the executive director of the National Primary Health Care Development Agency, NPHCDA, Faisal Shuai. He disclosed this while addressing Christian leaders on the second phase of the COVID-19 vaccinations, uh, Delta variant, Shuai said, I am glad to inform you that from this phase two of the COVID-19 vaccine rollout, we have introduced Sunday vaccination. And the analysis is that those states government had actually implemented as the first governor in the Nigeria uh, to uh, implement the policy of no vaccine, no work in Edo states. They say that uh, every unvaccinated people would actually be barred from public spaces. That uh, although this move was re initially resisted, but the governor, Godwin Obaseki, had actually stood his ground that this was going to uh, be fully adhered to uh, in his own state. He said this to Tribune, uh, or, or, and a report by Tribune Online disclosed that uh, as from 15th of September 2021, that health officials and security operatives have been trained at entrances of different ministries in Benin, the Edo State capital, to enforce the order and, you know, give restrictions of access to large gatherings for unvaccinated residents of the state, as directed by Governor Obaseki Godwin, where they said that any of the people working with the government would have to produce at least the certificate of the first jab of vaccine before they can be allowed entry into their place of work saying that they are actually not forcing people to take the vaccine.